My name is Stephen Holso. My job title is aerodynamicist and I work for Lola Cars in Huntingdon. An aerodynamicist means analysing the flow of air over the car and the two primary roles of my job are, I suppose you could say, to reduce the drag of the car and to increase the downforce of the car and both, both those things help the car go faster, which is our end goal. I was probably influenced quite a bit by my dad and, um, and his brothers and my granddad, who everyone in my family was into cars really, so I was, I was just always around cars from a pretty young age. My dad um, owns and runs a garage, so um, quite often instead of playing in the park I'd be mucking around in the garage taking bits of cars apart. I was always taking bicycles apart. and making go-karts and things like that and yeah anything mechanical and I was quite fascinated by. Being a race car designer is um, yeah a kid's dream job really so it was for me and um, thankfully I managed to after quite a lot of hard work get there and managed to do it so I think I do have a pretty sort of logical and straight thinking brain and I always just thought right what do I need to do to get the job that I want um, and just did whatever I had to do really. For me, university was a great experience. It was, it was really good fun and um, quite a challenge at times. Um, I studied aeromechanical engineering at Strathclyde University in Glasgow. Again, I always sort of knew throughout university I had this end goal of, of wanting to, to become a racing car designer. So I was coming towards the end of my degree and I didn't have any job prospects lined up, um, so I was thinking about oh, what am I going to do with a, with a few months to go before the end of my degree, I didn't have a job offer lined up, so I wrote off to loads of different companies, um, all just with this letter saying, have you got any jobs or is there anything that I can do? And um, Lola offered me a two week summer placement and it went really well. I enjoyed working here and I think they saw something in me which was quite good and later on that year they actually offered me a job. So um, I think that was one of the big things that I learned and that I would, I would sort of pass on a piece of advice I would say to somebody else is um, you've got to be sort of proactive in, in finding your job, finding your career. Um, I didn't have any prospects but I just got on and wrote to loads of places. and. Um, one company took me on and from there I've got a fantastic job. Outside of work my biggest sort of passion I suppose you could say is cycling, um, mountain bike racing particularly. Um, I've travelled all over Britain racing my mountain bike and um, I love it, it's fantastic. It's, um, it's a really good sport, it keeps me pretty fit and um, it's good fun as well, it's a good buzz sort of flying along on them. Um, on a good track through the forest is pretty good fun, yeah. I think I'd probably go for the one I have at the moment actually, it's, it's pretty good. I can't really think of, honestly, of many other jobs that I would do. Um, I guess I'd love to be a professional sportsman but unfortunately I don't have the talent to do that so as a paid job the one I've got at the moment is pretty good.